Oils are a staple of our cooking pantry. We use oil to season our salads, add flavoring to our baked veggies, or keep our pan sliding to cook chicken or meat. But not all oils are created equal, and it is often hard to find out which oil is the healthiest. In fact, while some oils might be considered healthy, the way you use them can make a huge difference in your health, especially when it comes to brain health. Some oils will gain or lose health benefits depending on the specific cooking temperature. Some might be beneficial at any heat, while others will need to be avoided entirely. So what's the deal with oil? And how can they benefit your brain's health? Don't go anywhere and keep watching. In this video, we'll reveal the top five worst oils you need to steer clear of, the one component you need to watch out for, and the top five best oils and how they interact with your brain. But before we jump in, can you do us a favor and like this video? Ring the bell for future notifications and make sure you subscribe to Brain Health Smarts for more videos. Plus, stick around to find out how you can get a free gift. And now let's explore the top five worst oils starting with number five, grapeseed oil. You might be surprised to find grapeseed oil on this list. While this oil is not the most popular addition to our diet, it is easy to assume that grapeseed oil would be healthy for our brain and overall health. As it is most commonly extracted from the seeds of grapes, grapeseed oil is considered a natural vegetable oil. But what you may not know is that this oil is rich in omega-6 fatty acids. Omega-6 is a polyunsaturated fat. When consumed in high amounts, this compound has been linked with increasing inflammation and chronic diseases. Small studies have found that cooking grapeseed oil can force the omega-6 fatty acids to react at high heat and form free radicals. When our brain is exposed to free radicals, it can suffer nerve damage over time. An animal experiment also found that grapeseed oil may contain harmful amounts of polycrylic aromatic hydrocarbons, or PAHs, which can cause cancer. However, certain experts note that any type of free radicals may help the brain to adapt and become resilient against harmful chemicals. While more research is needed on grapeseed to assess its potential effect on our brain, it is best to avoid this unusual oil. Even if you don't plan on adding it to your pantry, be wary as restaurants often use it for cooking. Number four, corn oil. While you might love eating corn, corn oil is a vegetable oil that must be avoided if you want to maintain a healthy brain. That's right, corn oil is far from healthy. In order to become an oil, corn has to go through a lengthy refining process that strips away most of its nutritional value. In the end, corn oil is mostly made of omega-6 fatty acids. And as we have seen, consuming omega-6 fatty acids in excess is detrimental to our brain function. But what does excess imply? Well, experts talk about a fatty acids ratio. Both omega-6 and omega-3 fatty acids are good for us when the ratio balance itself is at four to one. However, when you consume corn oil in small amounts, that still gives you an omega-6 to omega-3 fat ratio of 46 to one. Pretty unbelievable, right? This implies that even small consumption of corn oil can put you in excess of omega-6. A review of 13 animal studies and 14 human trials even found that an unbalanced dietary ratio of omega-6 and omega-3 increases cognitive decline and dementia. So does that mean you should stay clear of corn oil if you want to keep a healthy brain? Most likely, as corn oil offers little nutritional value or health benefits. Corn oil is mainly used for frying food because of its high heat resistance. So be wary of what oil is used when enjoying fried food. Number three, soybean oil. Soybean oil is a vegetable oil known to be largely available and versatile. You can use it to fry, bake, or roast any dishes. But just like many other oils out there, soybean is rich in fatty acids, and you would have guessed it, omega-6 fatty acids. In the case of soybean, some studies have specifically linked this oil to adverse health outcomes. An animal experiment on mice found that consuming soybean oil led to negative metabolic changes, such as increased body fat, fatty liver, and blood imbalances. These symptoms, often precursors of diabetes or heart disease, have shown to impair cognitive functions by reducing the turnover of healthy red blood cells in the brain. What's more is that experts also note that symptoms can take a long term to manifest, which puts your health and your brain at higher risk of impairment. 
Another mice experiment found that soybean oil can increase neurological conditions such as autism and Alzheimer's. So while human studies are needed to confirm the long-term negative impact of soybean oil, it is best to avoid it and choose healthier alternatives for your next daily dishes. Number two, vegetable oil. For years, doctors have recommended favoring vegetable oils when cooking or frying dishes. They believed that vegetable oils were somewhat healthy because of their natural origins. However, recent studies found that most vegetable oils are purified, refined, and chemically modified, leaving no nutritional value or health benefit to those who consume it. Vegetable oil, like any other oil, is prominently made of fat, and that includes unhealthy ones, such as trans fats and omega-6 fatty acids. So what do these bad fats have in store for your body and your brain when you consume vegetable oil? Well, while they can be easily consumed in excess, trans fats and omega-6 can also trigger chronic inflammation linked to the brain. Researchers found that trans fats, also known as T-fats, attach themselves to the brain cell membrane and disrupt the neuron's ability to communicate properly. This phenomenon causes an impairment of the nervous system, depression, and risks of Alzheimer's disease. So which vegetable oils should you stay clear of? Vegetable oils include peanut oil, rice bran oil, and sunflower oil. Number one, canola oil. Canola oil is extracted from a plant, so it is hard to comprehend how something this natural can be so bad for our health. But the reality is that canola oil is made from crops that are genetically modified. In fact, 90% of all crops in the United States are GMOs. What is more disturbing is that canola oil is mainly used as animal crop and fuel alternative to diesel. So while it is clear that this oil doesn't belong inside our body, what happens when you actually consume it? Canola oil contains varying levels of omega-6 fatty acids and trans fats. And because of its components, canola oil is known to increase fat imbalance, inflammation, and risk of chronic disease, including Alzheimer's. A mice study found that consuming canola oil regularly for six months could lead to chronic neuroinflammation and impair memory. So while human studies involving canola oil are needed when it comes to brain function, this oil has clearly shown to increase blood pressure and blood lipids, which creates a negative ripple effect on healthy brain function. All in all, it is best to avoid canola oil entirely and choose healthy oily alternatives instead as part of your diet. But as we have seen so far, all oils contain a certain amount of omega-6 fatty acids. So does that mean that there are no truly healthy oils out there, especially for brain health? Not quite. In fact, we are about to explore the top five best oils for brain health. But before we do, are you ready for a free gift? It's called The 15 Worst and Best Foods for Your Brain, an ebook that reveals the everyday foods that can harm your brain and increase your risk of mental disorders. Plus, which foods can boost your brain health big time? Check out the link in the description below this video. And now let's dive into the top five best oils for brain health, starting with number five, fish oil. Often used for Asian dishes or as dietary supplementation, fish oil is rich in omega-3 fatty acids, which provide a lot of benefit for your overall health and brain. Our brain is made up of 60% fat, and most of this fat is omega-3 fatty acids. So as our brain cells continuously regenerate, it is important to consume a healthy amount of omega-3 regularly. In fact, some studies have found that those experiencing certain mental disorders, including depression and schizophrenia, had lower omega-3 levels in the blood. Alternatively, researchers found that consuming fish oil can reduce symptoms of mental disorders. In a 12-week study, experts found that consuming fish oil daily reduces the risk of progression of schizophrenia in young people. Another study found similar results linked to the decreased risk of mania, depression, and bipolar disorders. Along with that, fish oil has been linked with reducing inflammation, body fat, and blood imbalances. This makes fish oil an outstanding choice, not just for brain health, but also for our overall health. Experts recommend consuming between 200 and 500 milligrams of fish oil daily. Number four, sesame oil. Sesame oil offers more than just rich and nutty taste to your dishes. Derived from sesame seeds, the oil provides a surprising amount of health benefits that may be good for your brain. Sesame oil contains sesamol and sesaminol, and these are two strong antioxidants that reduce oxidative stress and free radicals. 
Experts found that free radicals can impact neuron formation in infants and children. They also note that it can increase chronic inflammation and risk of disease in adults. So it is crucial to limit our exposure to free radicals. Thankfully, sesame oil may be able to help with that. A rat experiment found that sesame oil can inhibit nitrix production in the body, which produces free radicals. But that's not all. Sesame oil also has surprising health benefits for our sleeping habits. A study found that applying sesame essential oil topically could improve sleep quality after two weeks. So should you add more sesame oil into your diet? Why not? Sesame oil is versatile and can be used safely to fry or marinate dishes. Number three, walnut oil. It is no surprise that walnut oil would be one of the best oils for your brain. Walnut is often linked to brain health and not just because it's shaped like a brain. Walnut oil contains ALA, a type of omega-3 fatty acid that has been shown to improve cognitive performance and slow down age-related cognitive decline. A 2015 study from UCLA noted that adults who consumed a quarter cup of walnuts daily had higher cognitive abilities. But do walnut oils provide the same benefits? Experts think so. Walnut oils have been linked with improving blood level markers, including blood pressure, blood glucose, and blood lipids. These factors negatively impact the blood cells in the brain, so consuming walnut oils is great for reducing them. A small study in overweight and obese adults found that those who consumed walnut oils significantly improved blood vessel functions in the body, including the brain. As a result, another study found that walnuts may decrease risk of stroke, depression, dementia, and Parkinson's disease. So go ahead and experiment with walnut oil. It is a perfect add-on to pasta dishes and baked goods. Number two, coconut oil. This one is widely known as a superfood thanks to its medium chain triglycerides, also known as MCT fatty acids, and antioxidant properties. Coconut oil is versatile and fueled with health benefits that are really good for your brain. When we consume MCT fatty acids through coconut oil, our body turns them into ketones. Researchers found that ketones can have powerful benefits for the brain, including reducing symptoms attached to epilepsy and Alzheimer's disease. A small study in Thai children found that eating a ketogenic diet rich in MCT reduced brain seizures by 50% in more than half of the patients after three months. Another study in elderly patients with Alzheimer's found that ketones and MCT can reduce Alzheimer's symptoms and improve brain functions. Along with that, coconut oil has also shown to improve blood lipids and heart health, making it a healthy oil with plenty of direct and indirect benefits for heart health. So go ahead and add it to your diet, but limit your consumption to two tablespoons per day. Too much coconut oil can have adverse effects when consumed in excess. Number one, olive oil. Yes, olive oil might just be the best oil for your brain and overall health. Extra virgin olive oil in particular is showing promising results. This oil contains important compounds to reduce brain inflammation, including polyphenols hydroxytisserol or HT, oleocanthal or EVOO, and oleic acid, also known as OA. These compounds have shown to influence acute brain inflammation disorders, including multiple sclerosis, or MS. An animal expert found that HT and OA inhibit pro-inflammatory proteins linked to MS. Additionally, a 2019 study observed that EVOO may slow down the progression of Alzheimer's disease. Extra virgin olive oil provides strong anti-inflammatory effects that clearly benefits our brain. Further research notes that enjoying a Mediterranean diet rich in olive oil can decrease depression, enhance memory, and improve mental health. Whether you want to enjoy it as a sauce for your salad or as a cooking oil for your meat and other warm dishes, olive oil stays stable and healthy at any temperature, making it one of the best oils for your brain and overall health. So go ahead and add it generously to your diet. And there you have it, the top five worst and best oils for brain health. So tell us, which oil are you most surprised about? And which one are you going to add or eliminate from your diet? Share your thoughts with our community in the comments below. And before you go, remember to like this video, subscribe, and hit the alert bell to stay up to date with us. And don't forget to download your free gift. It's our brand new ebook, The 15 Worst and Best Foods for Your Brain, which reveals the everyday foods that can harm your brain and which foods can boost your brain health big time. Click the link in the description below to download it now. 
Thanks for watching. We hope you have a healthy day.